The new iPad Pro 2024 is a big deal. Announced during Apple's Let Loose event, the new iPad Pro now has a thinner design than its predecessor along with an OLED display and the Apple M4 chip. The latter is noteworthy not only because of Apple's claims about its performance and efficiency boosts, but its AI capabilities. I briefly went hands-on with the 13-inch iPad Pro 2024 and was impressed by Apple's premium tablet. The lighter weight and thinner profile immediately stood out. This isn't the big and bulky iPad Pro of old. In fact, I want to call this the iPad Pro Air because of how light it feels. The new OLED display also impresses with 2 million inch to 1 contrast ratio as the stark blacks and whites left my jaw on the floor. Also jaw dropping is the price. The iPad Pro starts at 200 more for both sizes versus the previous generation. Based on what Apple has said about the iPad Pro 2024 and my time with the device, the company's tablet seems poised to be a winner. The thinner design, OLED panel, and the promised performance of M4 could make this one of the best tablets yet. The new iPad Pro launches May 15 with pre-orders available today. The iPad Pro starts at $999 US dollar and features an 11-inch Ultra Retina XDR display, 256GB of storage, Wi-Fi connectivity, and an M4 chip, packing a 9-core CPU and 10-core GPU. That's 200 more than the $799 US dollar starting price for the M2 iPad Pro. If you want a model with nano texture glass, you will need to upgrade to at least one terabyte, which runs the cost up to $1699 US dollar. Adding Wi-Fi plus cellular costs an additional $200 US dollar. Then we have the 13-inch iPad Pro, which starts at $1299 US dollar. This model features a 13-inch Ultra Retina XDR display, 256GB of storage, Wi-Fi connectivity, and M4 chip packaging a 9-core CPU and 10-core GPU like the 11-inch model you will need to upgrade to 1TB to get a nano texture glass display. Note that models with 256GB and 512GB of storage have M4 chips with a 9-core CPU and 10-core GPU. Configurations with 1TB and 2TB of storage have an M4 chip with 10-core CPUs and 10 GPU cores. Lastly, there are the peripherals. The new Apple Pencil Pro costs $129 while the Apple Magic Keyboard for iPad Pro will set you back to $99 for the 11-inch model of $349 for the 13-inch variety. Apple didn't bump up the entry-level price of the iPad Pro M4, which is appreciated. Unfortunately, you will have to spend a lot of cash for nano texture glass since you can only get it with models packing 1TB or 2TB of storage. I will need more time with the iPad Pro M4 to make a final determination, but right now I think it might be the tablet to beat for power users. The tablet ticks all the right boxes, including a slimmer and lighter design, a powerful processor, and a gorgeous OLED panel. Are all these upgrades worth an extra $200 US dollar too? I'll have a full iPad M4 Pro review for you soon, so stay tuned.